Okay, so the deadline for the LGO to get a response from the council was the 14th of August. It is now the 5th of September. And I've emailed them, and they've said I was still awaiting the response, and they're not setting a deadline, even though they set a deadline, and that was a month after the whole thing. So they've had a whole month to complain, to respond to that. Now they've basically had two months and they still haven't responded. And even emailed me, oh no, we're still going to wait for the council. And, you know, that there's the whole impartial investigation thing, where there's the whole inquiry into DWP delays. Now, I emailed the LGM and said, could you forward all of your information based on this case to this inquiry? And basically, the LGO is meant to be impartial. They've gathered all the evidence. They have everything to do with it. All they have to do is send it to the inquiry because it's relevant to the inquiry because that's what the whole thing's about is the delays in housing benefits and the problems they've caused to me. But no, they've said, oh, no, we're meant to be impartial. We won't do that. Um, it's relevant. I'm not saying, oh, be on my side. I'm saying forward details of this case, which are relevant to this inquiry, to the inquiry. Because it would save me going through all the emails and doing six ton of work to supply the information for the inquiry. It is not saying, oh, please, please support me. No, but you're being biased to the council. You're not impartial. You're giving them extensions to deadlines on extensions to deadlines five times past their final deadlines oh yeah final response what is this the fourth final response and it's still beyond that you know they've replied with final responses they've given final responses and you know they're clearly responsible oh no let's give them even more time let's give them even more excuses to get out of it like give them every possible chance to get out of it it's like no they're clearly responsible. You've established that four times over. It's gone to different LGO investigators up the case chain. Now just get on with it. Stop giving them extra time and going, oh, let's start this whole case again. Fucking hell. And the council still missed their deadlines and delay and ugh. How long do you need? You had a whole month. <laughs> and now you're extending them again indefinitely. And it's basically been another whole month. What the hell is going on here? Just get on with it. So you're trying to give the council any excuse. You're not being impartial here, are you? You're screwing me over by, you know, going far beyond the acceptable time limits. I mean, a month for that was fucking long enough. And now what? You know, you're giving them a whole extra month on top of that month where they've not even responded. Come on. What is your problem here? Just get on with it. And why can't you give impartial facts to the inquiry that are relevant to the inquiry so they can be investigated. Oh no, we don't want to do that because that would get the council in trouble. We can't possibly give them all the information about this case relevant to this inquiry. No, that would be too irresponsible and apparently taking sides. Bollocks, what it? Come on. What the fuck is going on here? This is beyond ridiculous. And the LGO is supposed to be impartial? Bollocks, is it? Feels like they're on the side of the council every single time. And it's like, come on, you've established the council that's a blame. You've established that they're not doing things correctly. You've established that they haven't given me the correct score to rehouse me. You've established that they haven't given the correct facts or supplied the correct information to be able to rehome me. You've established that they don't respond from the correct departments and that they don't email on time and that they ignore responses and that they take fucking months to respond to one fucking email. <sighs> and you still need further proof that they're fucking it up? Or is this just to establish quite exactly how much I'm being inconvenienced with four years? Well, it's over four years and still fucking months and months and months being added on to extra time waiting for responses. Just get on with it. Get me back to Birmingham. Give me compensation. Let me get on with my life. Unless you're going to give me six million pounds. You know, I'll wait for six million pounds. As if you're not. Then just get me home at least so I can get on with my life. Because the longer you're fucking me over, the more compensation I'm really going to need to make up for it. Because this is beyond a joke. 
It is beyond a joke. <sighs> I literally, I don't know what else to say, but <laughs> it's ridiculous. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.